You know, some people have misconception of Islam. We have to remind them that Islam was born to promote education, right? اقرأ باسم ربك الذي خلق خلق الإنسان من علق. Can you please make a guess who founded the Walfas University, male or female? Um, I think it's a female from um, Egypt who made the first university. So yeah. Almost. Almost. Yes. Was uh, it was it a Muslim or? Yeah, she was. Yeah, she was Muslim. Can you name her? I forgot her name. <laughs> uh, Fatima Al Fihri. Oh, okay. From Morocco. Oh yeah, Morocco. Yeah. Uh, yes. Do you know the name of the university? No. no. Today I'm going to tell you the story of Fatima Al Fihri, the woman who founded the World Fast University. Fatima Al Fihri was born in Tunisia. Tunisia is about 3,000 miles away from Baghdad. Baghdad was the center of the universe at that time because of Islamic Golden Age, because of House of Wisdom. So House of Wisdom was founded by Caliph al-Mansur and then it was really established by Caliph Harun al-Rashid. Uh, but it was mainly, um, uh, it was mainly uh, expanded by Caliph al-Mamun. Uh, so, uh, Muhammad Al-Firi really wanted to bring his family, his two daughters from Tunisia to Baghdad. But he wasn't able to do that because the distance. So instead of bringing them to Baghdad, he moved his family to Faj, or now known as Faj. Faj is an Arabic word. Faj located in Morocco. Faj the city Fars also was big on education. The Fars was really built by Idrisia family. Idrisia family was a member of Quraysh family. The family belonged to Prophet Muhammad, the founder of Islam. And Muhammad al firis family also belonged to Quraysh family, the family that belonged to Prophet Muhammad. So what he did, Muhammad al firi he moved his family from Tunisia to Morocco, Tunisia to Fez. Uh, so they really received a good education. Uh, uh, the the, the Fatima al firi received a good education there at Fez. And also her father, Muhammad al firi he made some fortune in starting a new business in uh, Fez. al firi also married to a rich businessman. However, one day Fatima al firis father and Fatima al firis husband, they both died in the same year. They left a big fortune for Fatima al firi Instead of continuing the business, instead of investing money in the business, she founded the World Fast University. Al Karawan was the place she was born, so she named her university Al Karawin. So Al Karawin University was started the construction 859. It was the first day of Ramadan. So she kept fasting for remaining two years until the finishing of the mosque. Once the mosque and the learning center, which later became an university, finish, she prayed to Allah, she prayed to God, thanking him to finish the construction of the world first university and it was 861 and she was the fastest student to enroll the university this is something unheard of she was the fastest student to enroll the university she founded to learn math and science she devoted her entire life in learning promoting math and science education not only to the muslim people but also to women so when we talk about the university like columbia university we're really thinking of Fatima al firi because Fatima al firi al Karawin University, the University of Fatima al firi uh, founded 861, paved the way for a university like this, the Columbia University.